So I was just sitting out here on my dock back there, which you can see. Drinking a beer, relaxing, taking a day off, you know, not really a day off, I already worked, but relaxing for the evening. And I'm looking around my yard and I'm like, my God, there's a lot of crap around here. I started thinking about Jeff Foxworthy, that you might be a redneck if, and I took a walk around my yard and this is what I saw. So these are all key ingredients to being a redneck, I guess. All right, flip the camera around. I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. First of all, I'm gonna start with this beautiful pond that I built. Ain't quite got the fountain done yet. Still gotta build that. Then you circle around here. Oh, a chainsaw. That sucker's been out here for like three weeks. It's the beach I'm building. You can't be a redneck without a random canoe and tripod, not to mention the freaking water tank. We come over this way a little bit more. <laughs> you can't be a redneck without a dang gun tractor. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Just play, man. It don't. You could be a redneck without having a tractor. I ain't judging. <laughs> By golly, you gotta have at least a half a flamethrower. I mean, there's half of it. <laughs> That's an all free with some with some oil. You gotta have that too. Let me circle here. Ah, shovel, rake. Gotta have that with a random spray can of foam. Duralast battery. Ah. What kind of redneck are you if you don't have a Duralast battery in your yard? What a loser. And a broom. To top it all off, the ace in the hole is a cushion. Yes, that's correct. And we come down this way. Now we got random artificial grass samples. <laughs> Broken chair. It's random low voltage wire. And uh, that thing that should be on the dock. Then you gotta have, you gotta have a John Deere dog, you know what I'm saying? And then the, uh, the pallet. That if I return it to Lowe's, I get 15 bucks back. Heck y'all. I mean, and what, what yard is not complete, but with a backhoe attachment, just randomly sitting in the yard. You gotta have pallets. Pallets gotta be everywhere. Pallets, wood, everything. It's gotta be everywhere. Random tires. That's a very big must to be a redneck. Not to mention the smoker and behind that, the shit tank for the RV. You gotta have that. Gotta have it. Number one, plus random grill. Uh, obviously this is a given. Oh, <laughs> the fifth wheel. Oh, oh yeah, you know what I'm saying, buddy. That's, that's legit right there. Random forks on a pile of sand. You gotta have that. You have to have that. Not to mention the toy hauler. And lights have to be on all the time, even though your electric bill's through the roof and it's very, very expensive and you probably should turn all that crap off. Ah, uh, table saw, chop saw, random wood. Oh, has to be out here. Keep walking. Tool trailer. You have to have a tool trailer. Yeah, open all the time. All the time. With a flat tire. Very important. Very, very important that you have the flat tire. Not to mention, it's got to be parked next to a five-gallon bucket of hydraulic fluid and diesel fluid. I mean, I'm just saying. These are very important key factors. And then over here, obviously you gotta have random ramps that should be in a dump trailer, but they're not because you never put them back. Obviously, very important. Fishing poles, spare tire, ladder with a ratchet strap, gotta be there. Very important things to be a redneck. Uh, not to mention the random pink four-wheeler next to a brand new water hose that was on sale. It was a great price, I bought like a ton of them return items to home depot heck yeah gotta have those on the ground not in the truck where they belong and random charger gotta have that with a broken trailer very big must to be a redneck random hitch obviously uh four by four truck sitting here with rust and it's gotta see dustin smith construction group one you can't have a driver without a Z28, let me tell you what. <laughs> and by golly, that hood better be popped. Oh, it is. It is popped. That is good. Coming down the road. Random shop back. Gotta have that. Random trash can. Gotta have that too. Lush County, baby. And then random washer and dryer. Who doesn't have a random washer and dryer in their yard? 
or driveway, whatever. Random ladder, very big important thing with oil. You gotta have the oil randomly out the front by the by the garage. You gotta have a random fan with an old cup of coffee in it. And the garage, don't get me started on the garage. The garage has gotta have a bunch of four wheelers that don't work. And then one random Trans Am. Gotta have that with extra tires and a motor lift. Boy, this is getting bad. Walking around to the front of the house, you have to have an RV poop pipe. Gotta have it, very, very important. Random random pole that you want to one day make a flag pole, but you probably will never do it, never. Also gotta have random trailers. Always gonna have random trailers. Coming across here, you have to have a mud truck. It might be your son's, but you have to have it. Gotta be here. Tag can't be legal, cannot be legal. Uh, always has to have a flat tire, very, very important. Your cable line for Spectrum, Cannot be buried, has to be above ground. Uh, you have to have a hood on the side of your house with spare tires next to an electrical box that is not safe. Very important to be a redneck. Uh, crooked AC, very important because you hit it with the backhoe. Not me, but somebody probably did. Random pool heater that you will probably never install, but you got it because it was free. I'm just saying. Random toolbox, going to nowhere. Gotta have, must have random Trans Am fenders. To be a redneck you gotta have it got to have it come across here random tools they gotta be just spread like this which means no order you gotta have a random broken 70s rear windshield broken it's this is one of the biggest things very important then the to top it all off this is the icing on the cake if you want to be a redneck you have to have a random tank in your yard very very important. Subscribe. Watch all the other stupid videos I have. And yes.